When you check off your list at the grocery store, filling your cart with all your food favourites without giving it much thought, the Mustard Seed Food Bank in Victoria, along with Thrifty Foods, want you to remember that someone in your community is having a hard time doing the same. And we want to try and make life a little bit easier. Every month in BC, nearly 100,000 people turn to their local food bank for help. This number includes about 8,000 seniors and 30,000 children, all struggling to feed themselves with necessary nutrition for a basic healthy diet. But there is hope for those people, thanks to the 2013 launch of the annual Food Bank's BC sharing coupons. Every time you head through the checkout at your local grocer, you can add a donation to your grocery bill your way of taking part in the fight against hunger. Now, director of the Mustard Seed Food Bank, Brent Palmer, and I thought we might demonstrate to you uh, what you need to do when you go through the checkout. So let's start putting these aprons on, uh, Brent. Continuously rallying support for local food banks and creating awareness when it comes to the real victims of poverty. Brent has been instrumental in a career spanning nearly three decades. Are you sure you haven't done this before? The beauty about technology. Even after a couple of heart attacks and bypass surgery, he's still lending a helping hand. Maybe when I retire, thrifties will give me a job because they're going to need it. Yeah, you can be the <laughs> greeter at the door. I can be the greeter. Friendly face like that. So Brent, you look good in that apron. I've got some of my favorite groceries. Talk me through this. So you scan my stuff, right? Yeah. Then I have to, you're, you're going to ask me something. Right here, right in front of you, you notice a coupon package. It's in the denomination of $2. If you'd like to contribute $2 towards the Mustard Seed Food Bank, that goes towards feeding 7,000 people that we look after per month. I would encourage you to purchase one of those. If you would like, after we run your groceries through, keep your cash register till tape, because at the end of the year, you can claim that as a charitable donation. By getting cash rather than actual food donations, what does that help you to do? The beauty of programs like this and cash donations, it enables me to come back into this store along with my colleagues and buy the, the type of foods that we, as well as the nutritional services, feel is necessary to feed people with. Uh, we have 20 stores on the island, 29 stores in total with the mainland included. Uh, all stores will be participating with this promotion. We've been doing this for so long within our stores that it's just, it's part of what we do. Since the province-wide program began in 1997, it collects an average of $1 million each year. But donations have been dropping off in recent years, at a time when more people are turning to the food bank. And when it comes to children, they're the innocent victims. You people out there in the public that can make a different difference, a big difference in a child's life. In Victoria, I'm James Green.